Hello guys, what up? This is Dr. Olive Alex, and I know it's the very first time ever I don't show any preview video. Um, usually I make one before I even start with the tutorial, but I'm pretty lazy and I don't have time to do so. And also I want to say sorry that I don't upload any new video for the past uh, month now. Like I, I supposedly to make a new video after I. Um, I upload the, the last one a week later after that but I don't and I do make a giveaway so I, I just want to announce the winner real quick and so here's the name popping on the screen right now so congratulations and you can DM me through my Instagram to claim your um, Vegas Pro 14 um, license key it's a legit software so congrats and for you guys out there who don't win it's okay I might be you know making more giveaway in the future um, you can always try again so don't be sad so today I'll be giving a new sort of transitions that I made for the past I made a few months ago but I just pretty lazy to make tutorials on it because I have super busy things to do lately and also I go for some short holidays but anyway uh, once you download my presets you know I, I won't explain how to do it and stuff um, so you can just watch my previous tutorial just to know so once you already download the presets I'm gonna press the effects button and also I just want to let you guys know you will need a Sapphire plugins that's it only Sapphire plugins needed so it's called the smooth slide slides um, this transition is pretty similar to the the slight transitions that I made a couple months ago but this one have a little bit uh, sort of character and sort of movement so you can play it with yourself so you got left and right and up and down of movement so I want to choose left and right and going to the right and <clears throat> each of these left and right or up and down have its own unique move also which is either going down or up so I just want to select down which is now which is a as usual a is for the clip number one so once you do that you see the keyframe select both of them and drag it till the end of your clip you want to repeat the same process for the second clip but this time you want to select the B which is for of course your second clip once you add you don't need to adjust anything and make sure you overlap your clip roughly about two frames and let's build the dynamic ramp review and show you how the video looks like <clears throat> there you go all right i think that's enough for now let's play it there you go smooth so hope you guys like this new transitions i'm actually pretty bored making transitions i have a lot of cool effect that i discover and create but i just don't have the the time to make on it. I'll, I'll try my best to make a tutorial on it. There's a lot of things I want to show you guys. And also, if you are looking forward to get sort of um, stock footage, you can visit Video Hive in the link down below. They offer you pretty uh, sweet, you know, stock footage you can buy for affordable price. And also, same goes to sort of uh, audio. If you're looking for audio, you can also check out Audio Jungle in the link down below. So, thank you guys for watching. See you guys next time.